Welcome to today's video where we will be covering the top tips to getting started with your NG Desk account. When setting up your NG Desk account, it is important to configure your essential support channels, define user access levels, use custom ticket and user fields, and set up business rules and automations. The first and most important tip for getting started with your NG Desk account is to configure your essential support channels. These include email, social media, and knowledge base. First, you will want to set up your email channel. This will send all support emails into your NG Desk account as tickets. A centralized support environment where everybody has access to tickets allows your team to share the workload and prioritize tickets to different agents or teams. When you set up your email channel, you have a lot more power with workflows and automations. The next channel you should configure is Facebook. You can easily connect your company's Facebook page so that all posts and comments also come through as tickets in your account, where you can manage and respond to with the same automations that you can use for email. The last channel you should set up is your knowledge base. When you set up your help center with how-to articles and FAQs, you are providing a self-service channel. This can be extremely valuable to your support team because your customers can go out and find answers to their questions themselves therefore reducing the number of support requests your agents must deal with. Tip number two for getting started is to define user access levels. In your NG Desk account, you have the separation between customers, agents, and system admins. This is an important step to consider because you need to determine which users will have unrestricted access and be able to configure the account. These users will be your system admins. Then there are the users whose primary responsibility is to respond to and manage support requests, and who will have restricted access when it comes to configuring certain features and data. These will be your agents. You can also create custom user roles to create more specific user groups that have similar levels of access or permissions. Tip number three is to take advantage of NGDesk's custom ticket and user fields. This relates to what data you want to collect and track on both support requests and users. By default, with NG Desk you have ticket fields such as priority, status, and due date that are important for basic ticket management. However, you can create custom ticket fields as required by your business. This provides an effective means of customizing the information you can collect on a ticket. Next, User and Organization fields, which shows all the different information collected on users in terms of who they are and their interactions with your support team. Storing this relevant information about your users can be valuable information for reporting in the long term. Finally, it is important to set up business rules, such as pre-made responses, views, and triggers. Pre-made responses allow you to gain efficiency through repeatable actions. You can look at how your business operates, and if the same issues appear repeatedly, standardize how it should be handled. Then, with one click, trigger actions that will help them resolve customer issues. Another way to increase productivity is by using views. You can filter and prioritize tickets by creating different custom views. Views are a great way to set up workflows for your agents, enabling faster response and resolution times. Then there are triggers. By default, your account has triggers such as sending a confirmation message to the user that their support request was received. You create additional triggers and define your own sets of conditions so that when certain parameters are met, specific actions are triggered. Triggers provide efficiency and power beyond your inbox. This brings us to the end of our top tips for getting started with NG Desk video. By configuring your support channels, defining user access levels, using custom ticket and user fields, and setting up business rules and automations in your NG Desk account, you will be well on your way to streamlining your customer support operations. If you have any questions, please contact NG Desk Support.